Northwestern. <laughs> Purple, don't you? you? You you had some big games against them. Is it is it just that your game matches up well with the way they play that zone? Just talk about what it is about you and Northwestern. It's just that um, the zone they play one three one. Just, uh, just always having to find open spots and always my guards always giving me the ball when I need it and so I'd be feeling good. Juwan. Uh, you know, when he got, I think he hit five threes in the first five minutes of the game. And just, I mean, obviously the answer is it was huge. But just talk about how important that was to get you guys going. Uh, it was really big. Just because uh, against Northwestern, you always want to get a good start. And, uh, you know, that's key, you know, playing against those guys. Because if they get a lead, uh, they're going to use a lot of clock and, you know, just kind of run, play the way they want to play. So uh, getting a lead early on was definitely huge for us. And uh, Etuan did a good job just knocking down those shots. Ryan, yesterday we talked a little bit about, you know, the defensive end of the game. And, uh, you know, Sherman and Crawford came in as the fifth leading tandem in the nation. I think they had 12 or 14, and these two got 50. Uh, just talk about how important it was to take Crawford and Sherman out of the game. Um, that was huge. Um, I know that they, they may have been the whatever tandem, most scoring tandem in the nation, but we got the uh, first or second. Here. <coughs> third, third, okay, yeah. <laughs> but uh, with the, with they, uh, most people don't know about these guys. They, they play defense, too, and they're, they're really good defenders. Uh, I think the last person I want on me in practice is Etuan. So uh, he did a great job uh, covering Ca Crawford, and we did a great job on Sherman, and, and that really helped us to win the game. Ryan, you uh, missed the first five, made the two that mattered. Can you just, uh, just kind of talk about it? Um, obviously, you struggled early, kind of shaking that off. Um, well, I had a, obviously I made some shots against Michigan, and uh, I was a little confident today, and I wanted to get some shots up um, early. But they were flying at me. I think I was rushing a little bit. I think that hurt. But once I realized uh, that shot fake was working and, and finding other guys, and you know, throwing it to each one who was on fire there for a while, um, and that, that just I just let it come to me. And you know, every time I went to the bench, they were saying, "Keep shooting, keep shooting, keep shooting." And I, I finally found a couple openings there in the second half, and, and thank God they uh, they went down. Ryan, they were hanging around, hanging on. Every time you got a big lead, they'd crawl back in. Then you made the diving steal. You run down the floor and hit the three pointer. How big a play is that for you? Um, that was huge, I think. Uh, but um, I mean, we wouldn't have uh, the ball wouldn't have been there for me if we, we didn't have defensive uh, pressure on the ball, and, and they uh, they got a deflection there, and it was loose, and I, thankfully I got it, and Lewis made a great pass, and I got one to go. Etwan, talk about the hustle plays. Obviously, Ryan just talked about his, and I think you had uh, one early in the first half. That's something coach always preaches, right? Oh yeah, definitely. Um, that's what we thought was the winners of the game. I was playing them, I played harder than them, and that was one thing we got accomplished today. And the team did a good job. I mean, they ran dope for a few balls, I dove some, and that's the effort we did every game. Juwan, uh, you know, it, it's a little thing, but, uh, you know, you played Michigan, which shows some of that backdoor stuff. I asked Ryan this yesterday, but how much, in your opinion, did having played Michigan and then earlier having played Richmond help you prepare to defend Northwestern? Um, I think it helped. Uh, it kind of got, you know, especially the younger guys pretty much introduced to uh, Simple, you know, kind of a style that Northwestern would play, but uh, Northwestern is probably, you know, the king of it, you know, just all the back doors and how good they are with it because, you know, how much time they really spend on it. But uh, I think it was, you know, good that we, you know, saw Michigan and Richmond, uh, especially for the young guys just so they could get introduced to it. Ryan, how much of a process was it you just kind of getting in a flow versus, like, whatever happened under the basket there and you just getting picked off? Um, I, I, that really, I, I did get a little mad there, uh, got, got a little emotional, which uh, probably shouldn't have happened, but I think that did help me in the long run. I think that, uh, you know, I got every, got everyone fired up. Um, Drew told me uh, in the locker room before we came over here that after that happened, I just had a different look on my face the rest of the game. I don't know what that, I don't know if that, maybe these guys need to slap me around before the game. Right? <laughs> <laughs> so I don't know. Juwan, when, when Northwestern runs that 1-3-1, one, one, so few teams are able to get the ball in deep. <coughs> What, what kind of sets? What did you guys do where you you could post up uh, Thompson and, and get the ball like that? Especially um, the first half. A lot of stuff was kind of you know over the top uh, or going to the wing. Uh, you're pretty much one on one with Juice, you know, the whole time. So a lot of looks that you're going to get are going to be pretty much over the top, where you know they can just pretty much throw up, you know, where only pretty much I can get it, and I can try to make a quick play to the basket. I think you had a, I think you tied a career high in points. You your most threes you ever made, most threes you've ever attempted. Were you just, I mean, those, the first five minutes you had 15 points. I mean, were you feeling that something special was happening? Oh, yeah. Um, especially once once the first one went down. Well, actually, I think my first one, but then the second one went down, then I'm like, okay, then I hit uh, another one. And after that, you just started feeling good, and, um, getting some of the rhythm, and that's what happened. Ryan, when you came off the court, I believe that you gave a standing ovation after you fouled up. Uh, did you notice that, or have you had?
you had one here before? Um, I, don't, I don't know. I don't think so, but um, whether it was well-deserved or not, uh, I think everyone just played a great game, and we all did what we had to do. And they're, they're a good team. They're going to win a lot of games in this conference, and, and it was just a great win for us, especially uh, to start off 2-0 in the Big Ten. Hey, one more question for the players. Jawan, do you feel you did a good job limiting Luka Merkovic? Mm, do better. Um, I mean, a lot of stuff might have been scouted for it, uh, but I think I gave him too many catches on the block. But, uh, you know, I definitely can get better at it. And, you know, I guess the most important thing is we won, and I didn't cost us too much. Hey, then.